This is Marcel Brown serving you up some technology history for July 21st and 22nd. July 21st, 1999. Apple introduces the iBook Laptop, the first mainstream computer designed and sold with built-in wireless networking. I remember working at the time for a corporation and being on the forefront of evaluating and testing the then-known as 802.11b wireless networking protocol. This was before the term Wi-Fi had been coined. I was really impressed with Apple in having the foresight of introducing wireless networking at the time. Indeed, Apple's introduction of the iBook helped spur wireless networking into the mainstream. July 22, 1980. One of the most important yet little-known dates in technology history. Representatives from an IBM facility in Boca Raton, Florida, where a small group of engineers were secretly developing the IBM PC, meet with Bill Gates and Steve Ballmer of Microsoft to discuss licensing software and an operating system for the still-developing PC. Not having an operating system to offer IBM, Microsoft will eventually buy the rights to QDOS slash 86DOS from Seattle Computing Products, which they will in turn license to IBM as PC-DOS and later license to PC clone makers as MS-DOS. This alliance between IBM and Microsoft forms one of the most dominant platforms in the history of computing, which goes on to crush nearly all other PC platforms in the 80s and 90s. Ironically, this platform nearly crushes IBM itself as they lost control of the platform to PC clone makers in Microsoft. That's your technology history for today. For more, tune in next week and visit my website, thisdayintechhistory.com. Music